Alrighty then, I guess we're just going to go live and not worry about doing any settings with the music. Everything decided to go crap on me again. So the screen doesn't look too bright right now, I guess, on my end. I still haven't got it figured out right with my... Uh, Shaders, pulling the right shaders from my screen and everything, so. I was rushing to get a few things done. And currently messing with some more things on the stream side of it. So give me a second here, ladies. Double check everything. Oh boy. Let's see. Alright, looks pretty good. You guys hear me pretty good? Mm. Uh, yeah. Alright, on delay. Let's go. Hey, Chris. Hey, Sins, sure. Whalen and uh, Preacher, Mike. I am doing good, Chris. Except, oh no, I did buy it. All right, we're golden. I am doing great. Uh, we are on Monteith, Iowa, by Dr. Modding. His latest work in progress map. And so far, so good. A lot of things have been fixed. A lot of things have been changed around just from playing through and finding little small stuff here and there. I think I'm... Hmm, yeah, we'll go this route. I gotta get my combine going again. So, this first little bit I didn't get as far as I wanted to last night, but the first little bit, just got a little field here to harvest. Huh. What is with that distant texture being green where the straw is? I'll have to look into that stuff. Like I said, work in progress, and I moved a lot of things over to this map that I want to be trying. And get set up for starter maps. So, looking through, there may be issues I find today, and everything. Well, I guess we got the beer cooler and a lock chain in here. Let's see what sh we can get into. Oh yeah, I hate this truck. For how many crap it's got on here. There it is. Alright. And I wanted... Ooh, skid loader. Ah, oh, nice, Chris. Uh, new jobs are always fun to start. I think I'm going to go a different route than the old school JCLs. I think I'm going to pick up the old L series New Holland wheel. I really do. Oh wow. Did not realize all that. Don't need that. Yeah, we're going old. I actually, I could not tell you what size it was, but it this is one of them I grew up on. Also, it was our skid loader after the little old one that JCL did up. Need forks, where are they? 
Uh, I don't like the br Ugh. Whatever. They're not black, they're gray, I know, but... I guess I'll have to live with it. Of course, why wouldn't they go on the other side? So this is not where the store is. I put my store deliveries here. So you guys jump in and whatnot when you first time ever playing this. If you do play this, it will be different. But I guess I can show it off quick. Um, probably should have done this right away. I love the fact that it's a split farm. That's just something that's like, it's just a crazy farm setup. Not much to it. This is the only farm you're going to find. We'll get back to the house over in that corner at some point. They'll point down there. We're definitely going to hit that at some point. Because I don't plan on doing crazy long seasons until I'm into bean and corn harvest. So definitely October is when we'll get into seasons. And I really like this old barn structure that he got in here. It's just a nice touch. Going down the back roads, there's always a barn about ready to fall over or <laughs> nothing on it whatsoever. Right now I'm still filling up my shop with everything I want. Easy, Rod. That's going way too fast. Can't look. Looks like fertilizer and herbicide. Water. Which one's bigger? We're going to chance it with this one. Oh, no. Hey, go away. All right, I'll take that. It's not the perfect sprayer trailer, but for right now, this is just going to be my all around trailer like any other job site. Jake, uh, I'm going to tell you to do Google search because I'm going to say the wrong place but I believe it's like central Iowa I could be wrong just search up Monteith Iowa no wait that'd be different um I don't know <laughs> if any of you guys are around Dave don't tell him that oh what the heck is with my realistic cab view going on it is messing things up like crazy. Yeah, that's what it is. Hmm. All right, and that cab view is not going to work. Ooh, Chris, city job. Have fun, dude. The, the, that is one thing I wish I would have done right out of high school is gone and worked for the state or the cities. Why is my game audio so loud? But anyways, yeah. Just to get set up at a young age so you didn't have to work back through it. Would have been nice. <laughs> I really don't know what I plan on doing on the save. It's more of a test to test a lot of my crops and files and everything. And also play through and help test the map. So I guess we'll kind of see where it goes. Right now I'm going for more crop. But I got straw being laid down so it's like... Maybe, 
Maybe not. I don't know. I wouldn't mind trying to do some cows on it, but... Maybe we should just do a small bee farm on it. I don't know, I'm open to suggestions. Thanks, Mike. I appreciate that one, dude. But, uh, <laughs> this one has a similar No Creek feel. And I've just, since testing it, yeah, I'm in. I'm all in on this one. There will be more to come with No Creek also. But, uh, it's being a single farm on the map is the No Creek feel anyways. Feel, excuse me. And the quality of DR's decoration, uh, decorating a map is unbelievable because I don't have the patience for it. And when No Creek came out in 17, that was a similar feel. So just to have one that brings me into the 22 feel of it is great. I should have bought the hitch for this so I could have moved the prayers and stuff around. And whoever made this and put air brakes on it, or I, I should shame you. I still think my game's too... a little too loud. KJ, how you doing, man? Oh, come on. Ooh, doo -doo -doo -doo. What do I all got coming up? I really need to worry about. I'm not sure. <laughs> Jake, uh, extremely western. Letting me uh, test that centerfold, Kinsey. The model is out there on the internet. I'm pretty sure I've seen it floating around. A few other guys were thinking about putting it in too. But uh, it's a current work in progress. So it needs to be finished. It's not mine to share, but I'm still going to show it. So extremely Western Iowa modding is part of Western Iowa modding. There's actually two guys there. And he has been around, been, not been around, but I was looking at this tree. You know, from a distance, if we paint that branch white, it looked like a nice big old cobweb up in the corner. A little big, but still be something. Oh, I need some freaking header trailers, too. What I forgot. Oh, boy. Uh, Mike, that crap is off. What width of head do I even have? We got the 25 footer. Corn fed, you made it! Then I need to find, I'm actually going to have to buy a corn header. Oh, those are his new ones for the older combines. Uh, 
Oh boy. Who knew? It is going to be one of these. I guess I got a small combine. Better just go with the six row head, huh? Gap's probably going to be too wide, personally. I think it is going to be too wide for this combine I'm using. What happened to my other ones? Or do I just always use case that much? No, wait, I got it. Hmm. <laughs> I forgot what combine I had on the save. Jeez Louise. All right, where's my windows? There we go. You know what I really want, Jake? I want a really nice eight-row white corn plant planter. Not necessarily a centerfold. I mean, I'm not saying anything bad about it, but we don't have any that fold up, you know? The wings fold up. That is, like, one of them I kind of really want to do. A nice eight row corn planter. I don't even know if we have an eight row in game anymore. Yeah, Tillman, you can tell him yes, you would, but I'm gonna chance it. Mike Davis, uh, you can always. You can always get the dry corn add on. I do have the dry corn add on in my mods folder, so when you guys see stuff like that, it's always in there. I'm not even gonna lie. Oh, stupid tab button. But, uh,. I won't run anything without it. And now you guys just reminded me about something. In the process of testing the map, since he has those bends on there, I am going to do it up right. All right, so two of these need to be the dryer for sure. Till we can board a different green complex. Now, I got to finish these, so no. So I know that they are good for uh, public release, and then I will release them. All right. I don't like how much they brought up the ground. Hmm. Thought they were doing that little bit of smoothing should be fine I do need to get more paintable textures then wow
Huh. That one will have to be added into the map XML too. Good to know. Because those plants should go away, just like the grass does. So, that's another fix. The seasonal foliage just looks so much better. And, uh, I'm planting way too close to the bend, I know, but I don't care right now. Okay. Something like that. Yeah, maybe. Maybe not. A couple more of them in there. Jake, I get it. But, uh... I don't know. If I was to do up a planter, it'd have to be a white. That's... I think that's about the only way I could work on a planner. Thanks for the questions. Oh, I can't even remember the numbers on our old white, but uh, I agree with you there. That thing lasted forever, dude. Hey, one thing I never did check. I wonder how he did them up. Give me one second, guys. I'm going to go look at something quick. Need to get bought with farmland on those fences. I know it has farm ID one on it, but yep, that's no big deal. I was just thinking because you could easily place a little cattle lot back here kind of on a slight hill. Just looking at it, this would probably be even better yet because it's so flat. I don't even know what I have in here for cow barns. Almost fits. What color is that? Mmm. Uh, I don't want to get into da ah, too big. That's legacies. Could just do a simple couple placeable feedlots. Then I do have an open face shed. Maybe we could make something work. Where'd it go? Oop, barn.
Uh, wrong buttons on the keyboard. I always mess up my finger placement. Maybe we'll just like move it down the road a ways or something. I don't know. That's to be determined. Ah, uh, Lee, no, that is not the new PDA. That just came with the tractor. It's so close. It caught me off guard when I first g jumped in it. Not even going to lie. I was like, wait, did I get it? Nope, I didn't get it. What else do we freaking need? I just like buying things, okay? Cultivator planner is a plow. All right, I guess I'm good. So how much are you going to charge me for this? We'll do that for right now. And that ain't too bad. PH isn't too bad. Could be better. Harvesting is not looking good, though. Well, let's buy some uh, farm ground. Here's the PDA. The That's a crick right there. If you guys are going to want to get to these fields on the bottom side, you're going to have to make your own crossing of the crick. There's been plenty of people that have done it already. But the reason being is you would need to go way out and around to get through these roads, and DR is realistic with it. So he, uh, he left it that way. I don't plan on buying any of that. I'm pretty sure it's all... Yeah, <laughs> 1.7 million. Good luck. Anyways. All right, those, the different color of green, I don't know if you can really tell. I got 15 inch row soybeans in here too. So the lighter green is the 15 inch, darker green is the 30 inch. It's just a matter of which one I want to do. Hundred and six acres. That's all soybeans. I think I better buy that one because it is right on my back side of my farm. There. Thanks, Mark. Hey, Kyle. Yeah, Lee. Yeah, yeah. Custom soil. Hey, if you guys haven't already, like the stream. And share the stream around on whatever platform you guys are on. We're only at nine likes. We got to get those numbers up, man. Let's go. Let's go. <laughs> Not the hearts in the chat. The st oh, man. There's a bunch of clowns in here. <laughs> oh, God. If they could behave, maybe, just maybe, I'll jump back into VC with them. I don't know. They'll probably kick me off of uh, YouTube for good. Oh, hey. That's what I could get. I should plant that field to alfalfa quick. I 
I. <laughs> okay. I doubt it, Tillman. They can't behave. See, I'm trying to stay away from the main brands. Just a little bit. You know, just just a little. Where did I get this thing? <laughs> kind of like it. But, is this a center pull, or? Okay, okay. So it can go anyway. This is a reskin Concord. Alright, that's cool to know. Um, do I have enough money? Because... I feel pretty risky today. Let's see what happens. Uh, not yet, Tillman. Not yet. Hey, Justin. Um, been thinking about it. I really haven't been outside today. <laughs> Actually, that's a lie, because I did go outside. I went and bought new tools from Farm Fleet. Gets me every freaking time. Literally, you can't walk into Farm Fleet without getting new tools. Hey, thanks for the sub, Josh. I. Alright, Kyle. I don't know any of your boys' real names in there, so like this one's really starting to get tricky. That is stupid hot. Come on. Come on. Connect. Now I'm just getting irritated. Hulk smash. I knew it. It's all set up there, but he made it a center pole. And I don't do that well. Nope. That one's getting sold. I don't like that. Too many buttons. Okay. If he would have done this one, that would have been pull type or pull behind type. There was this is still probably too big. Twelve meters. Yeah uh, I don't think I'm gonna go that big right away.
But who am I kidding? Better than all this John Deere garbage I got. <laughs> I'm done with it. We'll just go this one. What's the difference? Okay, sure. Uh oh, she's sliding. These came off of, uh, these came off of old school farming on Facebook. I don't remember who made them. I haven't tried them until now. But we're doing it. I hope they got the tie rod ends behind that. Probably not, though. This tractor doesn't turn near as sharp as I thought it would. I don't know, this will work for me. It's not kind of, it's not an Iowa thing at all. But I'm gonna branch out a little bit. Get out of my comfort zone. Hopefully this hooks up. Hey, hey, look at that. Yes, Mike, that has been fixed. You are out of here. Oh, don't do that. Come back here. We're just small farming with the air seeder boys. Don't worry about it. Um, it's a good question. CFL. I guess the closer I zoom in, the better it gets. I'll turn that back up. Give me a second. Because it was like super loud before. Thanks, Legacy. Appreciate that.
it's the Concord off of uh hmm? It's the Concord off of old school modding's Facebook page. I don't know who made it. I forgot. My memory isn't so good anymore. You're not wrong, Legacy. You're not wrong. Not saying it. He only hates on everybody, so that's okay. Uh, I need to bail this, too. Hey, I should probably get something to do that. <laughs> I hate picking up square bales. Absolutely hate it. But I think I'm going to go that route. No, I'm not. <laughs> Who did that one, Legacy? <laughs> I gave him too much power here, Dave. Way too much power. <laughs> you guys just behave over there, okay? Let's see if I can get round bales to roll all the way down to the fence. That'd be pretty quick and easy to pick up then. Now I gotta remember where he did this cut through at. I think it was this one. Nope, it's this one. All right.
Well, not even one wagon full, but that's what I get for probably not putting any uh, fertilizer and stuff on it with the easy dev, but yeah. And now I can finally buy the corn head that I don't know what I'm going to get yet. I probably should have got a bigger combine and everything. It'd go faster. I'm going to get a bigger combine. I can't take this little guy. Um. I guess I don't have a bunch in here. can't remember if this one would I think I need the STS they really didn't want to go this new but oh well here we are this one probably won't even run a 12 row to tell you the truth I'm good with the basic. Uh, nope, not happening. There we go. Now we go. Well then, shows you how much I look at base game stuff. I should have just got a eight row or a sixteen row planner. That's why it's. I need an eight row corn or er, eight row planter so bad, because we got eight row heads and like nothing. How wide was that thing? Nine meters. I'm gonna let that one up to Dave. Because right now it's in his hands. I think, uh, let's go, uh, 
sure. Let's see if this is anywhere close. Hmm. I don't even know if I'm going to be able to get that. Hey! <laughs> okay then! Let's do, do somersaults everywhere. Sweet. Well then, it's not even going to lift up high enough for the freaking... This is a disaster. We're going to go back to my trusty one then. Right. Looks like I'm buying a different planner, ladies. Not enough room. I put my store delivery in the wrong spot. Yep. That's what I thought. Close. Had to know. That was really freaking close. Oh, spawned it in a bad spot.
just like parallel parking. Nudge them out of the way. Bumper tap. I win. Maybe. Damn tree. Riley, what's up? Alright, so I need to get the beans out first to open up some bins. Perfect spot for you for right now. So we'll run. Um. Let's see here. Hmm. Run the old trusty Demko. Er, I mean honeybee. E issues. <laughs> Hey, wrong button. Kobe, what's up? I guess I don't even... I'm not going to worry too much about my alfalfa right now. We'll just get this flowing. Oh, I guess we're going to pay them a thousand dollars. Not happening on my watch. I don't even have anything to do with auto drive just yet but it's going to come so I suppose we better start messing with this stuff A uh, little short, but we're going to run with it. Not die crossing the road. There they are. I mean, the one plus side of Giants' seasons is we don't have to worry about bale rot. But that's also a downfall. <laughs> I mean, uh, oh god, realism modding. When they made that bail rat, I believe it was way too aggressive. But it was incentive to make sure you go and pick your bales up. Alright, let's see if I can do this without completely messing up the auger, which is impossible. Ow. 
I haven't seen a simulation. Are you saying there is, or it, you're asking? All right, I don't have my auger in the right spot. There we go. I still need a fix scal, darn it. I need to fix them. I haven't seen one simulation. Just, uh... I don't scroll around looking for mods as much as I used to. Okay. Oh, that's one of the most annoying things ever. Why did they put, uh... Why did they put consumes power on a gravity wagon? It's too steep for you? Hmm. You must live down there in one of them southern con er, southern states where you uh, don't get any snow. Where you at now, Kyle? can't see where I'm going. Window tint's too dark. Of course, I put it on the wrong side. I'm having an intelligent night. I always forget to fix that windshield wiper animation. <laughs> I don't know how many of you seen that.
I guess you got it right there, Kyle. You could say ticket, but I'm going to get tickets until they say I'm going to lose my license over it. Which one of you guys are going to be the farmer cop? Hmm? Hmm? You want to get the role play going on here? Drive around, give everyone tickets. All right, let's see what happens. <laughs> no, Brady, Brady, no. We're going to. All right, go I was around. In. I'm gonna go with the round brush. All right, yeah, we'll do uh We'll do voice chat and the co-op Discord here. So everybody's going to be in. I know most of you guys are watching anyways. DR's in there. He's messing around with whatnot. At that elevation. So I'm on replace. So What's up, there. buddy? Make a big circle. Just... Trying to figure out what DR is drawing in the ground. He asked me how hard it would be to make him a racetrack. I said, I'll give you a little lesson. <laughs> how easy it be. Okay, so once I get that elevation, now I just want to make sure my brushes are turned all the way up. I'm going to go to smooth. <clears throat> and then I'm going to catch just the edge of that piece. And I'll just smooth it out. Keep messing with it until it's finished. And then eventually, you'll have that sloping down, and this will be at the same. Oops, that'll be at the elevation you want to. You can also do slope um, instead of replace. But I'm not a big fan of slope. It's kind of tricky. Okay, that's. A bit ridiculous on my end. Okay. That was yeah, oh. stupid fast for the dirt uh, on this tractor. <laughs> cool. Did you learn something? I did. Okay. Will I remember? Probably not. Like a 65% chance. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I forgot about that one, Legacy. Thanks for catching me there. I forgot to share my stream on my own Facebook page. Oops. I guess that is something I could go do. Are you still streaming? Mm-hmm. I'll stream I'll share it a lot for another days. hour. Legacy's always got a fucking... Chop me on, uh, out from underneath. <laughs> he catches yeah. all the shit I always forget about. <laughs> Sorry, I had you back there. <laughs> <laughs> nah, it's good. I know, Legacy, I know. If I went to bed rushing trying to get this crops to work tonight and I actually pulled my head together. Like I said, I can't even remember where I'm at. I'm going to give up on those. For right now. I don't really need this. You already gave up? I'm not at that right now. I just want to drive this thing around for a little bit. Then we'll go how about you, how about you send it to me and I'll show you what it looks like on a racetrack. <laughs> Fine. <laughs> or we could have a race day. <laughs> no, because he won't send me the map, but I can send him the map. I know he won't. I know he won't ship it anymore. 
it, it's coming, guys. Just calm down. The race day will be coming someday. Oh, yeah. That'd be fun to have on stream one night. It would be. I might have to have Monica look at the car. Just to It'd be hectic as here. fuck. Yeah. yeah. But it would be that's, fun. That's why it'd be Have fun. you tried out that Outlaw Dirt Trek game? I don't do that one, to tell you the truth. I do yeah. iRacing. I've never tried I, I racing. I if you got a I steering race. wheel and everything, it is great. But hey, I just remembered something. I'm going to go to... No, I am going to public streaming. If you guys want to come up there, that's fine. So everybody knows when they come in and I'm on YouTube. That so is... watch the yeah, not a bad idea. bomb words. Yeah, so I'll be up there. Uh, so everybody on the stream understands what's going on. Legacy called me out on it, so I'm sharing it on Facebook. There. Uh, spelling right before he calls me out on that. I don't care about the caps. And I had to exit out of the game for the simple fact to get the seasons to work right. So as you can see, it's coming back in. That looks good. All right, let's roll. Old cat, what's up, man? Thanks, Legacy, you caught me. Um, Honestly, what you guys are seeing are not even the shaders I'm running. I had to tone down with uh tone down my shaders with stream labs so they're a little bit foggier than what i got i haven't messed with them perfect because for some reason stream labs will not bring in my uh my overlay i got from my screen i haven't got them to work yet and since I've been with uh, DR working on this map, I haven't had time to go back through everything. Looks like those are going to need another day. What the heck is down there ready to harvest? What? Okay. I gotta go check on that one real quick. Why did it what? That is not the way it is. He actually has really nice stuff in there. Must have ran out of room. And it cut off water plants for some reason. So this is why you test. And I know I'm kind of testing it live and whatnot, but... You look lonely. Is this farmers only? Yes. <laughs> uh, what are you doing? Just standing there? No. I got to do a quick test through Notepad. I mm -hmm. suppose here. Um, yeah, that's what I wanted to do. What am I doing wrong? You guys got me all confused now. <laughs> all right. I'm looking for a freaking error.
why the heck did it just change everything on me then? Oh, I love modding. I can never just play anything. Why? That is so irritating. It painted over what his happened? water. It painted over his water grass with alfalfa. Oh. Oh, that's a you thing. Oh, yeah. That's a me thing for <laughs> sure. I'll figure that out later. I mean, for right now, we'll just... Yeah, continue on. Go streaming. Yeah, I just had to check that. So that's a big plus now that I know that's going on. That's not how Dave's map works. No, not at all. There is actually water grass perfect in there. All right, I'm not waiting for this to go through either. So we are just going to F12 these in. What are we looking at? Uh, the soybeans that aren't ready. Bump the numbers up. Boom. That is one thing I do like about seasons, though. You can, uh, it does matter when you plant. So, if you got to get around your bends and everything, you might want to plant that field first to guarantee you got it ready to harvest. Was there soybean straw in? I can't even remember. No, I don't put that in mine. Oh, know why God. <clears throat> are these your 15s or are these your 30s? These are the 30s. Yeah, the 30s. Force play is going to freak out doing this one. No, the other field up north is ready with the 15s. But I didn't want to have to put the header back on the trailer to get through the gate. <laughs> And I need to get a couple, I need to at least get the end rows out so I can get to the corn bends too. So, uh, just to bring you up today, I did bring you a lot of my stuff over from my starter map because I hate testing a blank map <laughs> to this one. So every change I do here, I got to do on my starter map also and double check that everything works. At the same time, I'm testing a lot to do with Dave's map also. And it kind of all just works out, but the me problems are going to be a lot different. Now, let me go back to my... Settings, where are they? Uh, no. My... I'm probably going to break everything right here. Um, okay, we're just not even going to mess with them before I ruin the entire stream. We'll just let it be. I was going to show you guys, see if it would come through what I see, but I'll wait to mess with it some other time. You see, this double is not right.
another thing I gotta fix. Good. I hope somebody's taking notes. Oh, this field is such a pain in the butt. Or not field, but the farm with the augers. There's just, I haven't been able to find a good auger to fit this one. help if I'd be able to back up today. And cars. I think I'm gonna switch it up though and run a green card on this one. For now, anyways. course why so wouldn't it hit the wheel oh that's it in the collision underneath cute yes dairy yes Nah, I don't even know which one I want to run. Mike, thanks for the sub. I hate decisions, too many decisions.
Maybe I should have dairy, but I don't know. That I, I never bought this wagon blue. That kind of looks good. That bar is in a really bad spot. Uh, we're going to take the ditch on this one. I kind of really like that. It does look good. So, I'm looking good. Where's this combine at? Probably could have just waited, right? It is still moving. Maybe. <laughs> the T8000s look weird to me, but I think that's because I'm used to the uh, 8 series or 70 series, however you want to Genesis. There you go. And then the TGs. I'm really used to these. The new ones kind of just, I think they narrowed the hood too much and elongated them too much, personally. But I like running them, even in uh, the game. Real life is more fun, but... God, I can't believe I ruined those ditch. I got too much stuff going on. That would probably help out a lot. Get rid of GE. I don't know, Mike. Uh, I don't know what else he has in store for this map, so I'm not going to say much because it's his decisions on what he puts in and everything. I think I'm going to make a rip on the, with this combine myself. And then we'll bring it back. Uh, steering wheel come down? There you go. Looks a lot better. I'm pretty sure that's all of us dairy. <laughs> I'm I do it all the time. Open it, start a save, go, hey, I want to run this, but it's not quite perfect, so let me edit that quick. And then I never actually play through a full save game. 
I only made it to planting one time on one save game. <laughs> it's bad to say, but it's the truth. You're not wrong, Mike. I kind of like the idea of it being a beef farm, too, or a beef map. But I don't, I mean, it is a beta map. It is testing. Things are subject to change. And to get the most benefit out of it, I know you're already going to have to start a new save. There are ways you can bring some things from a current save to a new save, uh, new save, but not everything. So take it as it comes. And that's where the testing side of it, it is great to have a lot of beta testers. Everybody plays a different style. Everybody can test different things. But that is also where the downfall of being a tester is. Either you should just jump in, test, jump out, or you start a save and then you're kind of one of those guys that like, I don't want to start over. <laughs> so. I don't blame you, Derry. I know I've talked to quite a few people. They're waiting for a few 4X maps to come out and they said they're taking breaks from the game right now waiting for these 4x to come out because you know what that means when they come out they're going to be diving deep not a bad idea Mike Still on Midwest, huh, simulation? Overlays. Well then. My internet just decided to do random things. I gotta check on the stream health and everything. Uh... Looks good. Okay. <laughs> yeah. I don't know. Something happened. Wasn't my fault. Yeah, simulation. Uh, that's why I'm irritated right now, that alfalfa texture being in the ditch. That's all cattails. It looks beautiful, but I failed to catch that when I was testing. I failed to catch my bean stubble being too short, too. Which, I guess it's really not. You can still see the rows there, but I need to bump them up. Well, maybe not. I don't know, I might leave them alone. 
tell you the truth. Because you can... I don't like how you can see the rows in the distance, but not in the... Uh, my circle. I don't know. I gotta mess with them. I don't know what I like yet. I know, Jarhead. I just... I... In the distance, they look good. That's what I don't like about them. It's there, I guess. <laughs> Best thing I can say. Ah, yeah, Mike. Um, <laughs> I actually got a race next weekend, so this is like my weekend of be on farm sim and stuff. Going up into Wisconsin. Do one of my favorite tracks. Literally built right in the hills of Wisconsin, so you get to go up and down the valley. I got to get my other video edited also of uh, our last race at New Hartford. Oh, it's LiDAR. I mean, a lot of this stuff, you can see it when he brings it in to start building the map. He had these uh, drainage ditches and everything in already. And there's, uh, <clears throat> there's some fields he smoothed out already and everything. That needed more smoothing because just the way the GPS data comes in. Or the LiDAR data, excuse me. But... It is true to the area. To the T. <laughs> yeah. I mean, it's a flatter part of the map that I'm in right now. But you got the hills. And then you got the river bottom. I need to see what else I messed up while we're waiting for that combine to get filled up. At least want to get two rounds outside. The edge is done. This is where he's got all the combo of the plants done up. See if any of these other ones got messed up. Oh, little sandbar. Come on.
I hear you, Mike. I'm kind of in the same boat. And there are some good enduro races close by, especially in the Midwest. My son, on the other hand, he wants straight Supercross. <laughs> and that's where, like, I'm not ready for that yet. I like it, but I like more the motocross. And it's not jump after jump where if you miss one little thing, you're go a goner. Row Crop Special. Interesting name for YouTube. But yeah, dude, I agree. That's that's one thing DR always does is the little details in maps that they're easily missed. Oh, Derry, I agree with you. That is a struggle I've had for a while, trying to work through and smooth those bend spots out enough. Miss some, pick the header up. But anyways, yeah, to get the ditches smoothed out right, that one's a challenge in itself, and it takes a lot of hand work. Great row crop. And I'm not even sure if he used lines. Oh, that mirror's pointed weird. Okay, that's why I didn't see the wagon. Oh, hey, watch it. Yeah. <laughs> 
what rain mod are you using? The one that damages your equipment and everything? I don't... I don't know how I feel about that one simulation. I got the mud. What is that one? So when it rains, the fields get muddy and you get stuck. But they don't damage the equipment. No, not REA. It's the one that comes with Oops. It's the one that comes with the mud you can literally haul in a trailer if you wanted to. There you go, mud system. Yep. Alright ladies, I think this is going to be it for me tonight. About two hours. Ugh. I am shot. I'm going to figure this one out and uh, see why I got alfalfa in and everything. It's bothering the crap out of me. So I'll catch you guys next time. Hopefully to do quite a bit more live streams and videos on this map and also testing. Check you later.